Another thing you want to protect you, this Halloween is your teeth. All that candy from trick-or-treating can really wreak havoc on your mouth. Sean has more on that. All right, guys, a couple of Halloween fun facts for you to digest right now. The most popular candy this holiday, chocolate. No surprise there. The runner-up, candy corn. And boy, do we get our share of candy. Studies show the average person consumes nearly three and a half pounds of candy at Halloween time. And are you ready for this? Research shows the average trick-or-treater uh, consumes three cups of sugar. Three cups of sugar. <laughs> Let's put that into perspective. I have it here in my hand, three cups of sugar. And then I will throw it in to this see-through thing. It's still going. Still going. Not done yet. <laughs> three cups of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. If you want to be careful when it comes to your kids because all of that sugar can lead to cavities, here's something that may surprise you. According to Dr. Joe Harmon with Delmarva Dental Services, the cavities aren't necessarily his main concern. In fact, it's not even the kids he's worried about. It's the adults. The biggest thing with parents is uh, eating their kids' candy. Actually, my biggest emergency is when the kids eat, when the parents eat the kids' candy, they break their teeth. So actually, my biggest emergency on Halloween is from parents eating their kids' candy. Now, Dr. Harmon says many times, excuse me, wrong camera. <laughs> It's the hardness of the candy that causes adults' teeth to break. So mom and dad, be careful when you're sneaking into your kiddo's stash. Lisa and Jimmy, I know you guys would never do anything like that.